It's really, really hot, isn't it? Yes, it is. <laughs> oh my gosh. Here we go. Where are we going? That's for me to know and you to find out. That's right. It's a surprise for me today. Maybe I'll find another piece of river glass. But this is the Hall River. It's the Hall River, um, one of the last sections of it before it merges just downstream a little few miles with the Deep River and turns into the Cape Fear River. You can see a boat over there. It just docked and some people got off and they are walking. Not sure what that's all about. But look at all these rocks going down to the water. I want to go down there, but this looks like a treacherous sort of walk, doesn't it? People do go down though because uh, there are people down there fishing down this way. Look at the blackberries. Mm -hmm. That's like it was in my grandparents. Another month, uh, the house I grew up in had Huge, like this. See all the blackberries? Look at that thicket. Mm -hmm. That's all that is. Yep. That's what we had, and it was about that size. You could walk around it and not see the person on the other side. <sighs> My mom would love seeing that. We're walking down this gravel road, looking at all the plants. And here is a wild a North Carolina vine. And I don't want to step in the wrong place because there's a lot of poison oak out here. But look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Oh my gosh. We just rounded that corner and it is hot. The sun is very hot. <laughs> Shining down on us and you can see the dam there. We're going to walk down close to the water. We are seeing so many wildflowers. Look at the black-eyed Susan back there. Really pretty. All of these grasses. There are little asters in here. We've seen wild onions. They have pretty little blooms. Look at the pink clover. And there's some plantain. That's the narrow leaf plantain. And Queen Anne's lace. More beautiful flowers. The black eyed Susans. I don't think I've ever seen them with so much red in the centers. At first I thought they were blanket flowers. But we checked it and it's all Rebecca. Really pretty. There's a big old feather. I guess that's from a vulture. The water's down there. Oh, there's a heron down on the rock. So from here we can see where the Hall River is being released, like through Jordan mm -hmm. Lake. Yeah, and then it just continues a few miles down where it meets the Deep River. Mm -hmm. Look at all this water. Turns in the Cape Fear River. It's hot. Hot and sweaty.
We're walking back to the car, and since the sun is a little bit different, I wanted to get some more video. Oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. Hopefully you can see it better in this light. Well, we made it up that hill, and what time is it, 7.30? 7.43. We might do one more thing and then go pick up a pizza and some calamari and go home. So that's where we were. We walked down that road and all the way through those woods. And we came out down there and walked along there and then down by the water. There goes my baby. Come get in the picture. With the sun behind us. That was a good walk. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Look at this. Do you remember this from where we grew up? We're down at uh, where the Hall River leaves Jordan Lake. What county is this? Chatham. I guess we're in Chatham County, but not too far from Sanford and US 1. There's a lot of plants out here that make me think of us. There's a little bunny over there. <laughs> we will cross over the Deep River and the Hall River again on the way home. We are on our way to pick up a large pizza and some calamari from an Italian restaurant, and we will just enjoy the evening together. Thank you for watching.